All right, a local blogger is trying to make healthy eating easy. Her name is Annie Mello, and she just released an e-cookbook called Meals and Minutes. And this morning, our Vanessa Gomez is with her at Plum's Kitchen to check out some of the recipes in the book. Vanessa, good morning. Yep, hey, good morning. We are borrowing Plum's Kitchen this morning at the 8th and Railroad Center. So thank you to Plum's for letting yes. us take over their kitchen. I'm joined by Annie Mello, who has a brand new cookbook out. We made one of the breakfast recipes earlier. And Annie, we so we made one kind of on air and we yeah. had one ready. This one that you had ready, actually, it has onions in it. Yes. This one, we Did didn't not. put it mm -mm. in there. So I wanted to let people know, even in recipes, if it says an ingredient, but you don't care for it, or it's a little more time consuming, you don't have time to cut up an onion, then omit it. Mm -hmm. Don't have it. It'll still taste great. And then you can still have the luxury of a sweet potato yes. egg McMuffin. And I also learned that cinnamon, actually healthy for you. Yeah, it has great antioxidants. It actually can aid in weight loss. Which is always a good thing. Right? If so you are up that cinnamon, <laughs> especially like with pumpkin season right now. Mm -hmm. Pumpkin cinnamon is like the best combo for me, no one to man. I agree. Earth. I was trying to cut this bacon in half yes. and I'm just not going to. No, so while I take it. a little bite of this or maybe a large bite, who knows? Go for it. What are we going to be making next? So we're going to do a salsa chicken in the crock pot. Mm -hmm. And this literally to prepare takes mm -hmm. a minute and a half. Okay, so. first of all, oh my gosh, so good. You were right with the sweet and salty mm -hmm. flavoring of everything. Wow. And I know the whole basis of the cookbook is 30 meals and that you can prep in under 30 minutes. Yes. This took like five minutes. Exactly. Not long at no. all, which is awesome when yeah. you're trying to save time. Let's yes. go to the crock pot. So crock pot, we got a little Instapot going here. So in there, we're gonna make a little salsa chicken. Little so salsa chicken, okay. Yep, so this is great because you can combine it. It's an awesome family recipe because there's a lot of different ways you can do it. So literally what I'm gonna do is pour some chicken. How much chicken did you pour in there? Uh, that's about a pound and a half. You okay. can go up to three pounds, five pounds, however big your family is, you can freeze this. This is a great freezer meal. Okay. So if you want a little more and you don't have to cook a lot. Yes, and crock pots this time of year, so awesome because it's a hot meal with yes. this cold weather. So whew, super hard. <laughs> yes, that's it, that's, that's all it. you do. And then you're ready for dinner. And Plum says this awesome Instapot, which is amazing. I've used it here when doing a cooking class. It's really legit. And how much salsa was that? Was that a whole jar? That was a whole jar. Okay, a whole Just jar like of salsa. Just like a 15 ounce jar. You can do 24 ounce. If you guys love salsa, put more in there. Holy smokes. And then yeah. how long do you put it on for? So the Instapot will probably take about an hour and a half to two hours. I use a crock pot too, and that can take, if you're gone all day, I would put it on low for six to eight hours. And yeah. you can just leave it cooking. And we yeah. actually, we have some here. Who is looking and at steamy? I know, right? Oh, steamy so goodness. Delicious. Yes. All right, we'll try that coming up next, Sean and Cami. And remember, we are live on Facebook this morning, so feel free to head to our KSY News Facebook page, and Annie will answer all of the questions that you're interested in if you'd like. And you can find her cookbook. We have a link to it, it's an e cookbook at ksfy.com. All right, it's as easy as that. More tips, like Vanessa said, on Facebook, and she'll even answer your questions. So, yeah, you know, it's. Um it's hard to find something that's good, that's quick and really easy. And healthy, yeah. Yeah, and I, and I do love the crock pot. It's like you put it in there and then you forget about it and you get home and you're like, oh, well, that's right, dinner's, dinner's already made. It's mm -hmm. like you've had somebody there making dinner for you all day. Yep. All right.